Within all plan, you could create a new axis, or if you have an existing one, you could also bring that in, which I could show you in a bit. And when creating the axis itself, uh, we usually work in a plan view where we could define our northing and easting based on our geolocation. And then once we have that, we could build upon that point uh, with a straight segment for this example, we'll make it 225 feet. And then if you also want to add curves, that option is still available as well. So let's go ahead and test that out as well. Another 225 foot segment and give it a radius of 1000. Once we define the horizontal um, axis, we'll go ahead and define a profile for this. So going into the profile, it works similarly. We have uh, reference points within here. We could define the station and the height at the station. So for this purpose, we'll leave it at zero. And then additionally, we could define an additional tangent points to add curvature. So for our example, we'll go to the middle, give it a height of 40 feet. And then within the rounding, we have multiple options available. But for now, we'll use a parabola where we'll define a radius and we'll split the arc up uh, evenly between the distance. And we'll add one more point at 450, height of zero, okay? And then there we have it. We have the curvature for the profile. And then once we hit recalculate, it'll combine the two different 2D alignments and produce our 3D alignment with the curve as needed. Thank you.